to you today as someone who carries within him the true aspirations of Zeon. Hello everyone, welcome to Zeon Remnant's channel. In today's video, we're taking a look at my Figma Berserk Black Swordsman Guts figure thing. And something that really irks the hell out of me, his cape. Which he's not wearing, because the cape is crap. We're going to show in a second. I actually went out and I bought a replacement for it. And yeah, we're going to go over that. I'm going to be raging a bit, because I think it's ridiculous. And you'll see why in a second. But on a second note, I want you guys to know that I love Berserk. Um, obviously, if you can see here, I'm missing Void. I need the Void, and I'm missing the Berserker Armor Guts. Uh, we'll get them eventually. <laughs> um, I love Berserk. It's one of my, probably is my favorite manga of all time. And um, yeah, Eric, this is uh, this is it. And even more so, why this figure pisses me off. All right, guys. So we're taking a look here at my Black Swordsman guts. This is the re-release. The original figure was going on a uh, secondary market for about seventy-five or more dollars. The re-release came out was about forty-four dollars, and um, I got that one. And the figure, for the most part, looks pretty damn good. Got guts in his angry face. He's all muscle-bound. He has a lot of detail in the armor. He has a chain for his sword. Good articulation. A bit weathered. I, I like his prosthetic arm that he has. It looks really good. So that looks pretty awesome. What is not awesome is the cape that comes with this figure. So this is a figure made by Figma. Max Factory, whatever you want to call it. Number 359. Guts, right? Got this badass picture on the front. And we see on the back we have this cape. Now, on these promotional pictures, the cape doesn't look too bad. Looks pretty good. But then when you get the figure and you open and look at the cape, I would like to know what the fuck is this? What is this bullshit? It, it's like kind of like paper, kind of fabric felt it's folded over I mean this part looks good the actual rubber plastic part whatever the hell it is but what the fuck is this shit if I had went on a second hand market and bought this figure for like 80 bucks or whatever and I got this I would be furious this is unacceptable this is a joke I mean I have freaking Star Wars figures that are three inches tall that have better capes than this figure here this is supposed to be a, I guess, I want to say high-end figure. We'll call it like a medium-end figure. You know, it's like for a collector. What the crap is this shit? What, what? This is exactly what we're going to do with this. Fuck that cape. So what I had to do, because I refuse to have my guts looking like a loser and a lame-ass with a paper cape, I went to my good friends in China. And they make a custom cape that you can buy on eBay, and if they're still selling it, I will post the link down below, and it looks like this. Now this is a sewn cape made of fabric with these nice burn marks in it, with wires in the cape, so you can do all kind of neat poses with this. Now this is what should have came with this figure. This looks good, it's nice and torn like Guts' cape, it has posability, and it's not like a piece of paper that's wrapped around his neck. So we'll take this out of the garbage real quick for a comparison. Old and busted, new hotness. Unacceptable. Thank you, China, for making this. You're so nice. I like these. So let's put it on and see how it looks. Alright guys, and here it is. I'll put on the Guts figure, and damn, does that make a world of difference. Holy shit. This is awesome. The wires in here are really good. You can do all kind of poses. He's jumping down. He's going to go ahead and, and kill some apostle or whatever. He's going to attack Griffith. I mean, you can do all kind of stuff can have the cape coming around 
whatever. I'm going to do a slideshow at the end of this to see all the different possibilities. There are a ton of possibilities with this cape, and it makes the figure infinitely better. Thank you so much to the fine folks that are making these capes. They not only have capes for Berserk figures, but also for Fist of the North Star. I've seen some Play Arts figures, uh, with uh, capes for Play Arts figures, and just all kind of stuff. They're, I, this, I like the quality of it. I like the fact that it's like a, a faux leather. A real, it looks like a heavy material, uh, which Guts' his cape uh, looks like it's pretty uh, thick and heavy. And this is going to be great. I'm going to be messing around with this for a bit to get some really nice poses. And then he'll go back in the uh, Berserk shelf with the rest of uh, the Berserkos. So this is garbage. I, I really cannot even fathom who designed this cape and whose bright idea it was to do this. Because this is just embarrassing. I mean, damn. The old Band of the Hawk guts. I mean... He doesn't have a cape, but he has a sculpted cape. At least that looks better. And now that I've gotten this, I'm pretty sure that these same folks did make a cape for this Guts. And I'm very tempted to buy it now. And look, let's look at Griffith here. Griffith has a nice white flowing cape. No wires in it, but this at least looks like a cape. How they came up with this bullshit is unbeknownst to me and I don't understand. Even the Attack on Titan figures have nice sculpted capes. Well, I don't understand how this came to be. This abomination of Berserk. This is almost as bad as the animation on the new Berserk series. No, I'm just kidding. Nothing's that bad. Um, but this sucks. I mean, for a collector, this is garbage. So we're going to get rid of that. I suggest that you guys go ahead and if you want a good cape for your guts, if uh, you're not, if you're like me and you're not really a, a knitter or sewer or whatever you want to call it, um, go ahead and pick this up. As you can see, it is going to make your guts figure infinitely better. Leaps and bounds. Until then, next time, ladies and gentlemen, enjoy the guts slideshow. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Like the video. I'll be trying to upload more um, now that I've kind of dug myself out of my little ruts so expect more videos from me weekly at the very least and as always zig zion The sun eclipses and join as one. I will carry this blade to my grave, so I will never forget where I came. I will find it.